Already at ease in Australia, Sydney, like Sao Paulo, enjoys plenty of sunshine. The arrival of Juninho Paulista, literally translated as Little Julio of Sao Paulo, has lifted the marquee gloom that threatened to stall Sydney FC's pre-season plans. This little Brazilian may not have as much bling as Dwight York, but he's confident he can have the same impact, especially as he's been made to feel so welcome. It's fantastic uh, as, a, as a country, as a city. Uh, it's, uh... I've never been here, it's my first time here, but always when I speak to people that know Australia, uh, talk me marvels about, uh, about the country, about the city. So, and then about Nesid FC, is, um, the, the attention that they are giving me is, is, is incredible. Uh, uh, since I, was, uh, I get in the airport until now, so the attention is fantastic. How much do you know about Australian football as a whole? <laughs> Not much. Uh, I know a little bit because I have um, a teammate, Australian guys like uh, Schwarzer, uh, Luke Wilkshire. Um, they, they could uh, tell me a little bit about the Australian football. Uh, but uh, I, was, um, I live too far from here. Uh, in Brazil you cannot uh, watch a lot of Australian uh, soccer. Football is the universal language, and Juninho's skills translate well into any country. But Sydney fans are going to have to wait to see their new hero. He's not quite ready for the pre-season cup game with Melbourne this weekend. Well, I'm just starting training. Um, I'm training uh, four days now, so I feel the legs stiff. Uh, I think I need more time. Uh, I was um, I was training physically in, in Brazil, but not uh, not a contact with the ball. So it's it's, a, it's a quite different uh, when you when you train on your own, when you come to train with the lads. So I just need a little bit more time to 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 be fresh when I was in, in the field. And have uh, have the lads, the, the players at Sydney FC, made you feel very welcome so far? They they are uh, yes. Every lad is. Uh, Seems very nice guys, uh, give me very well uh, welcome. So just get it. As long uh, I stay, and then the better um, talk we we will do. So just a little bit more time to know each other, and then uh, have a great relationship. Janino has always had great relationships with the clubs he's played for, particularly Middlesbrough, whose fans nicknamed him TLF, the little fella. And that spell, along with a certain trip to Japan and Korea in 2002, provide the 34-year-old with his best career memories thus far. Well, I have um, a few uh, very good moments. Uh, the World Cup was, is one. It's incredible. I think uh, my, my second year at Middlesbrough was, was very good too. I was very happy. And then about the player, I think Ronaldo and, and Romario, I think is the best two players that I play alongside him. Why? Because um, they hardly ever miss a chance to score. If you give them the ball, and they are always in good position in the area, and then they finish it. It's, it's, it's unbelievable. Uh, I think the best moment, both best moment, was that uh, Barcelona uh, was uh, was incredible. Uh, and then Romario is still playing. Uh, and still finding a way to score uh, over 40 years old. So, uh, and Ronaldo also. So it's, it's a two great players. You won't be in quite as exalted company this season, but whether it be Sydney or the Seller Sao, the aims for a top pro are always the same. I think to play well, to give them what they expect, and also to have uh, success with the team, because uh, I don't think you are you are good on your own. Uh, the football is changed a lot. So one, two, three players doesn't make uh, uh, the team wins. I think is all 11 uh, is in, on the pitch. So that's that's the that I want. That's what I'm thinking too is uh, have a success with the club. Okay, and now you're in Australia. Do you know anything about cricket or Aussie rules? <laughs> Well, uh, about cricket, uh, was in, they show a lot in England as well. Um, but I'm not very good on that sports. <laughs> I prefer uh, the ball on the field and then, and then I can, I can I do a little bit. The little fella can play more than a little bit. 
And even if it may take him a little time to rediscover full fitness and his touch, he remains arguably the key signing of the close season. He should be great fun to watch.